Clearboro, North Dallas. This is the Tesla S Plaid version. Uh, finally got here from last week that it came by and the owner showed it to us. Uh, one of the first ones, I'm sure, in the uh, Dallas area. Uh, full wrap, Expel Ultimate Plus, topped off with a uh, ceramic coating over the top for that extra UV and uh, slickness uh, and that extra little shine that it gives. Not that it needs it, but it sure is a nice uh, topper to the deal. So. Uh, with our full wraps, we give a two-year complimentary, so no need for an extra expense. We got you covered. So uh, let's take a walk around this and show what we do here. So uh, wrapping all those edges, just like we do. I'm still getting them. I got a car outside that's just brought to me from another installer. It's absolutely horrible. Uh, no wrapped edges on a white car. And uh, I'm going to shoot a video of that. I'm just not trying to stir it up, but... Wrapping edges is important, people. Even coming around these points, wrapping that, wrapping here. That's your full fender. Everything wrapped in for that extra life of that product. When the edge is on top, it's gonna get dirty, it's gonna get beat up from washing. It's just the wear and tear is incredible. This surface is all wrapped around, nothing touches it. So you're gonna get the full durability and life out of that film. So here's uh, the full front, no lines at all. Coming around that camera all wrapped in, coming in our doors, our fenders all wrapped in. These A pillars, I did these custom so that they're all the way underneath and they're all the way around the backside. All this is all wrapped in. Those were done by hand. Uh, some things I just prefer to do that way. Doing these doors are all by hand. Uh, car not too bad with uh, debris uh, from Tesla. It was actually really good. Uh, there was some cleanup, obviously. Uh, this person here has only driven this car maybe 500 miles and down here below already a fair amount of rock chips and down here a fair amount of rock chips it happens that quick so each model has its sensitive points uh, on this one it's uh, below or in front of that wheel right here all this gets beat up and down below this rocker and then underneath this bumper down below there it takes a huge huge beating so I mean it's it's so bad underneath there already with a few hundred miles obviously this car has been already ex accessing the speed uh, that it likes to do but it's, you got to cover your car if you're going to do that when you're going over 100 things are flying at it like crazy so um, coming around uh, wrapping in all this here coming up wrapping under these lights wrapping in in these corners wrapping in this whole trunk lid wrapping into the window wrapping into the window wrapping underneath we don't want any lines on the car doing this A-pillar all custom, wrapping in this top piece. All this is done by hand. So no ring, uh, no removal of the wing. Client didn't want the plaid or the T taken off. So we just left it and went around it. Um, and then uh, finishing up on this side, much more of the same. And uh, that is about it for this Tesla plaid. And underneath that front bumper uh, goes in beautifully, fully 100% covered. Uh, underneath here, I already got some curb rash. So um, it's just, you gotta be careful when you guys are parking cars like this with these low front ends. You don't have to pull all the way forward to hit the curb. Think about the big trucks that park in those spots, the dualies and that. You don't need to hit the curb to know you're there. So watch out for your front end, give it a little respect. Uh, stop tearing those things up because uh, repainting the front bumper, it's not cheap. So there you go, folks, uh, 2020, Two, I believe they're calling it, or maybe 2021 and a half, uh, plaid model Tesla S, new front bumper restoration. So there's their new refresh on the bumper. So what they did is they copied it like a uh, S and a, uh, or a, sorry, a, a three and a Y coming around like this with that flat face. And then they refreshed the back bumper, believe it or not, and obviously, obviously the, obviously the interior. We all know the infamous steering wheel. Um, and they're now going to these cards for this car as well. So uh, obviously your phone controls it, but this now goes here and all that business. And you set it up on your council area to start it. Uh, and they refresh this back bumper, believe it or not. It's different than the uh, predecessor. So uh, there are some changes and that's about it. So thanks for watching Clearbrow North Dallas. Any questions, uh, clearbrownorthdallas.com or 214-414-3809. Thank you.